Energy. It comes in many forms and it's always in high demand. The Alberta Innovates Energy and Environment Solutions team is researching ways to store energy so it's available when you need it. When people go to work, they need to turn on the lights and turn on the computers. The electrical energy needs to be available when it's in demand. The primary challenge with energy storage is the fact that electrical energy in itself can't really be stored. It needs to be converted to another form of energy such as uh, hydraulic pressure or mechanical energy or chemical energy in order to be able to store it for later uses. By 2050, Alberta plans to reduce greenhouse gases by 200 megatons annually. Renewable energy will play a big role in this reduction. With certain forms of renewable energy, it's not always available. As you know, the sun isn't always shining and the wind isn't always blowing. The ability to store that energy so that it can be used when it's needed is going to play an important role in the ability to have wider adoption of renewable energy onto our electricity grid. To deploy renewable energy in a wider fashion, it needs to be cost competitive with fossil fuel energy and fossil fuel technologies. We're working on a number of exciting projects. We completed with our sister organization, Alberta Innovates Technology Futures, and a number of other uh, partners in industry uh, across the province. Uh, what's called a techno-economic evaluation of energy storage. There's a researcher at the University of Alberta, uh, Dr. Weixing Chen, who's developed a new battery storage technology. From our analysis, looks like it will be not only competitive on a technology basis or on a performance basis with the best available batteries today, which are lithium ion batteries, but also on a cost basis. Another project that we're just getting started right now is with a, a company called Rocky Mountain Power. And what they want to do is install a compressed air energy storage facility on the border, it would act as a virtual intertie enabling electricity to flow between Alberta and Saskatchewan and vice versa. The CCEMC has recently announced funding for uh, what would be the first grid scale energy storage demonstration in Alberta at an existing wind operation and we're partnering with Suncor and Tech to demonstrate battery storage at an existing wind farm. Working at Alberta Innovates Energy and Environment Solutions is very exciting. We get to be involved in a number of uh, very interesting and very cutting edge technologies which will play an important role in the future of Alberta's energy.